Randall here. And I wanted to just show off this really cool uh, K Parlor guitar that I recently uh, rebraced and sort of snazzed up and made uh, a little bit of a sleeper. Normally these little guitars just have the really heavy post-war K ladder braces. And, uh, and I was inspired by some other luthiers who've rebraced these similar sorts of guitars. But I did a little different. Usually people take out all the braces and just put a normal old boring X brace in here. And I've been playing more with the V brace style that goes way back a long time ago, but has been made famous recently by K introducing it on, or not K, by Taylor introducing it on a lot of their uh, new guitars. Um, and I'll show sort of the before and after braces up here. Um, but really, this has become such a great little guitar. Let me give you some of the specs here. Short scale, about 24 and a quarter inches. Uh, bu -bu -bu, let's see, Brazilian rosewood, uh, fretboard Brazilian rosewood, bridge, spruce top, uh, hardwood kind of back and sides. I'm not exactly sure what the back and sides are made of. They look kind of maple-y or maybe they're ply. The sides look like maple. Back looks kind of like ply. Whatever. Um, really unique thing about these these guitars is they have really skinny nuts up here. So it'd be really excellent for someone with small hands or uh, a child who's learning a guitar if you want them to have like a really great sounding little guitar. Because this would blow like any of those modern learner guitars out of the water completely. It's such a such a great full full instrument, and it's a blast to play. After I after I finish it, I couldn't put it down because it's just so comfortable in your hands. Really nice low action. Uh, I did a neck reset on it and managed to get the angle just perfect. So it, so I was able to uh, use the original saddle without cutting it down or putting in a taller one or blah, 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 blah. Uh, brand new, nice tall frets. So this thing should be able to keep going and making music for quite a while. Uh, little cosmetic things here and there, but overall it's in a really, really great shape for, for Players of any age, I'd say. Um, and it'd be a, a good opportunity to pick up something uh, for a relatively low price that's a, a really great and useful instrument. Anyway, that's about it. I just wanted to show it and give people a bit more of an up-close, personal view of what this thing's all about. Uh, go ahead and check out this listing or my other listings on my reverb page or wherever I might be selling guitars at any given moment. You know, these videos exist in the ethers for ever and ever. Anyway, that's it.